You haven't stopped smiling. Like, it brings back memories when I used to compete at London Youth Games as well for Haringey. But now to go on and help the kids bring it home, it's been a great honour and like, it's here, hopefully to stay because we started putting on plans to win it back next year as well. Yeah, it was, it was a very good feeling because obviously from what um, other people have said of how it's been ages since um, Haringey have won such a big trophy and as they said it's the biggest trophy at this level so to be able to be a part of that was a, it was a very good um, good feeling proud moment as well it felt good i like working with my team and when i won i felt excited and delighted uh, i won four and i got four medals it's a massive achievement um, to do something that we've never done before is is huge and it's not just it's not just for for the little teams that are involved within the borough it's for everyone in the borough um, it's been a massive challenge uh, to get everyone involved. I think we've had over, over 4,000 young, young boys and girls involved within the games for Team Haringey um, and that involves over all the 30 sports. So to be that consistent over that length of time and that amount of sports is, is a credit in itself to all the children in the borough. Well, the council leader, myself and the mayor have hosted a small tea and celebration for the young people from Haringey who have brought home the trophy from the London Youth Games for Haringey. The first time the council has won this fantastic trophy. What an achievement. And the people who've made it possible are standing next to me. Bert Gravis, who's well known across the borough, has been doing this for many, many years. Marie and Michael, who is organisers, who are teachers in the borough. This is such a fantastic achievement for Haringey. Our girls' football team, the athletics, the basketball players, and all the other teams that have competed. Haringey, for the first time in our history, is the overall winner. And I'm delighted that Michael, Burke, and Maria are here holding their trophy.